Hello and welcome to this My Theme Shop video screencast. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you how to create links on your WordPress powered site. Now linking is obviously very important. It's what allows uh, websites to communicate with each other on the internet. And thankfully, adding a link to your WordPress post is very simple. So here I'm just going to load up a post I've already written um, just by clicking on one here from posts. But this is the same for posts, pages, or any part of your WordPress site which is using this what you see is what you get editor. That means it's exactly the same process whether you're creating a post, page, or editing a current post or page on your WordPress powered site. And it really is as simple as selecting the text you want to have linked and then telling WordPress where you want that link to go. So um, here I'm just gonna highlight this text, finding a needle in a haystack. And then the link icon is this one here, which looks like a link. And you can see here it says insert slash edit link. Just need to click that. And you see you have um, two fields here. One is the link text. So that's the text I've just selected. You can also edit this here. Oh, it's the URL. So here I can just type in the URL, including HTTP. Um, and I'm just gonna have this going to mythemeshop.com. I just need to click add link and we're gonna see this is now blue and underlined. So that means the hyperlink is now active. If I just click update on my post and we view the post on our site, then you're gonna see that um, we now have this text, now a link. And if we can see here, finding a needle in a haystack is now a link. And if I click on that, then it's gonna take me to mythemeshop.com and we can see that there. So that's the basics of adding a link. And to remove a link, it's exactly the same process. You just need to select the text again. And you're gonna see you have either this hover showing up on the link itself, or you can just click remove link in the menu there. WordPress has a couple of extra features though, which make this even easier to use. If I just click insert link again, and we can see we can choose whether to open the link in a new window or tab. And you might want to do this if you don't want your visitors to be taken away from the page that you're showing them or you can link to existing content that you've published on your site already. And this just makes it really easy for you to use. So you can expand this section here and you're gonna see that you can either search or scroll through here to view all the posts and pages that you've already published. So if I wanted to link to this post here, I would just need to click that title and WordPress is going to automatically add the link in there. I can just click add link and we're gonna see that it's now added to the site. I'll just show you another example here. Um, perhaps we wanted to have this knight in shining armor. Insert a link. If we wanted to um, go to a new window or tab when opening the link, then um, we just tick this box here. So if I just send this to google.com and click add link. And if I update this and then we refresh on our site, then you're gonna see that if we scroll down first, we've got this link that links to another post on our site. So if we just click on that, um, then we're gonna see this goes to the other page on our site. And if we scroll down here, then the Knight in Shining Armor link is going to take you to Google in a new tab. Just one final thing to show you then, in order to edit a link you've already created, you just need to click on it. And then you're going to see, you can click the insert and edit link. And you just need to edit the URL or select a different page there and click update. And that's going to update the link for you. And that's really all there is to it. It's really simple. As I mentioned, um, it's exactly the same for posts as well as pages. And you just need to make sure you've clicked update when you are done. If you have any queries at all, then uh, please head over to community.mythemeshop.com. And thank you very much for watching.